name is AC Overdose, and welcome to the next episode of Super Mario Sunshine. Last time, we started Bianco Hills. That's our first world, or the first main world, anyway. And in this episode, we're going to continue. Um, now, just a little heads up. Right over there, that's one of the... Uh, I don't know if I mentioned that before. But that's one of the... Um, the goopy things that have, like, you know, you spray them, and then the, the head pops out, and... Whatever the hell it's called, I don't know what the heck it's called, but... Anyway, something I want to mention before I started, I forgot to mention this for the last two videos. Um, so, <laughs> it's kind of a, not a coincidence, but, I don't know, I kind of like how it, it ended up. So, my 200th video was a Versus episode, right? But, <laughs> it was so close from being the 200th video... To be the finale of Tack, and it was one video off from being the first episode of Mario Sunshine. I was thinking of just not uploading verses, but then I thought it hasn't been up for a long time, so I might as well. But yeah, so it went 201 for episode 1, 202 for episode 2, and now this is video 203. So I thought that was kind of funny um, how that ended up being, but <laughs> uh, of course it's gonna change next week because we have verses, but. I kind of thought that was a little funny, so there's that. And also, uh, the first episode attack is my most viewed video. Um, it actually has about just about 2,000 views, and look at that. Like compare that to all my others, and that's a whole butt ton of views. So, um, I'm really uh, I I don't know. I'm very surprised that it got so many, but then again, I'm not because there's not a lot of let's plays of attack and. For some reason, I guess people are trying to find the game, so I'll take it. I mean, of course, I don't do YouTube reviews or anything, but I thought it was kind of funny how um, how many views it's gotten. So yeah. Um, so anyway, we're gonna continue on mission four: Red Coins of Windmill Village. Oh, yeah, of Windmill Village. They forgot to put the Red Red Coins of Windmill Village. Wow, is that like a direct translation? It probably is, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know. Alright, so... We gotta go over here. No, I'm just gonna kinda like go up here and do my little route. So I get this one first. Now they're all on this side of the wall. Um, of course they're on the wall, but... You're not gonna really notice that at first. Alright, so we get that one. I probably should've just gone up the path, and then, yeah, whatever. So, they're all on the side of the wall, so they're really easy to find. There's another mission that has red coins on the other side of the wall, but for now, we're not there yet, so. Oh, 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 oh. close enough. Can I just, like, hover up there? No. Suck. Alright, I was gonna be like, psych, but never mind. Never freaking mind. <laughs> I'm upset. Okay. So, to get the shine, you really just have to just go on the rope. It's pretty simple. So, I have a little story to tell. So, <laughs> about... I don't know, when was it? I think it was two days ago now. Uh, Parker or PB Overdose was over, right? We decided to play, to live stream and record Super Smash Bros. Melee, and we're unlocking, like, everything, right? So we got, like, four characters unlocked in, like, three and a half hours. Three and a half hours straight of time, okay? That's how long it took to do this. Now, <laughs> the funny part is, <laughs> I looked at the video after, like, five hours of it processing, and there was no audio. The audio recorded, and it was on the stream, because people were commenting, like, I could hear it. They could hear it. So I was like, well, what the hell, like, why is this like this? Then I figure out, five minutes ago, when I started this recording, like, right before I started it... Wait, where am I even going? It's over here. Then I find out 
that the audio was actually on the recording, and it it was fine. I don't know what happened to the file, but yeah, maybe it was just too long for my computer to handle, but I have no clue, and I deleted it, and I'll try and get it back and like upload it this weekend or something. Screw off. <laughs> I'll try and upload it this weekend, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to. So, we'll see. Thank God for recycling bins on computers, that's all I'll say. Oh, why did you do that? Alright, so what what this is, basically Peter Piranha strikes back. This is the last time we're fighting him. But you gotta do that. Get down there super fast. Oh, he's doing a tornado, okay. Let's get rid of all that stuff. Yep, he's doing it. Camera, get out of the wall. But yeah, so that happened, and um, hopefully I'll be able to, to get it back. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. We'll see. So basically, he's going to start flying, uh, as you can see, and... Basically, all you're going to really want to do is just follow the shadow. Um, you don't even have to look up at him. So you can spray him to get him down more. Oh, wow, I got him down there. Alright, that's a weird spot to get him down. Get out. I, I really need that. <laughs> uh, sometimes you'll get water from those, which is really helpful. Can you stop using your freaking tornadoes? You're crying out loud. I know they're getting stuck on the fence, but it doesn't mean you gotta keep doing- You son of a bitch. Ow! <laughs> God! Thank you! Gosh. Your stomach is the slowest non-digesting stomach I've ever seen in my life. If that made any sense whatsoever. Alright, I'm hoping he'll go over there. I think I just spawned the one up that's over. Yeah, I did, didn't I? Alright, I'm trying to get the goop out of my way. It's not working the way I wish it would. Alright, so it's just three times you have to get him down, so it looks like. Actually, I think we might be able to do our trick. Nope, it didn't work. Stop with your freaking head movements. <laughs> Alright. Come on. Stop using your tornado. Just puke already. Thank you! Wow, he actually listened to me that time. It's funny though, because it looks like a freaking tornado is about to go off when he, uh... <laughs> when he's about to puke. It looks, it looks like he's about to die. I think it's like over here somewhere. Let's see how close we get. Yo, I almost got it. That was actually pretty close. Alright, so that mission does take a little while, but it's not too bad. Alright, so the next mission... Well, we're not even there yet, so... Just wait for it. Wait for it. I kind of like it how he does that. He does that in Mario 64 too, right? I think he does. I don't know. Does he take it? Yeah, he takes his hat off in Mario 64. Yeah. I, I don't know for sure. Because I, I don't remember, but I'm pretty sure he does. So for this, uh, it's another secret mission, hence the secret in the, in the title. So we gotta go all the way over here. Now the easiest way to do this is to just okay, is to bonk your head on the freaking mountain, yeah, because that's healthy. <laughs> the easiest way to do this, uh, I think they expect you to use those lily pads. But the thing is, when the water's contaminated like this, um, the lily pads, what they do is they decay after like 10 seconds. So that's not very fun. 
Now this right here, this is a nozzle. Um, you probably saw the the red one over. Can I can I get to it or no? Well, anyway, it's all the way over there on the other side of the mountain, and um, that one is the other one you can unlock. It's like it's over there. You've probably seen it before. Um, this is the turbo nozzle. So this one is my favorite. Basically, uh, you just hold it down and you go like 80 miles an hour. Now the reason I showed it off there was because if you do it the second time you come in, you're going to be stuck with that nozzle for the, uh, the mission. I don't know if it actually, it happens if you die. Like, I don't know if, I don't know if you keep it if you die. You probably don't, now I'm thinking about it. I don't know, but anyway. So you get these blocks, right? I love how these blocks look. They remind me of, like, Rubik's Cubes, don't they? Uh, so you get over there, you can just do that. Now, don't get hit by that. That'll... What those actually do is they're... They're supposed to, like, shove you off the edge. They're super easy to dodge, though. Now, I recommend just ground pounding as soon as you, like... As soon as you can. Just... It makes it easier can't slide very much if you do that shoot shoot no 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 no. okay it goes back down I got scared all right I also recommend uh, ground pounding on these just to make sure you land quicker now I've seen like these ridiculously fast like routes on that part I just go one by one and I just try and end up there I don't really know the pattern of those little platforms or whatever. I just kind of go for it. Jeez, we're already at 12 minutes? You'd be surprised how long these shines take. Jeez. I'm trying to make the videos like mid-range, not like 40 freaking minutes like I did with Tack. Tack was like a long game though, so you have to understand. Alright. Oh, I didn't mean to do this one. Crap. Alright, well, I'll explain this when we actually get to it, which will probably be next episode. <laughs> I'll just go ahead and, uh, not do that one right now. My bad. Actually, I don't know. I think we're actually gonna end it now. Just to make the ep next episode, like, not short. We're gonna end it now. So I know I only got, like, three shine sprites, but who cares. So... Next episode, we'll finish this world, and then episode after that, we'll start the second world, but... Yeah. So, thanks for watching. Like if you liked it. Dislike if you think it sucked. Leave your comments. All that good shenanigans is appreciated. And as always, I will see you all next time.